Today, I plan to share how you can manifest anything efficiently by following a very simple principle. Before we begin, I would like to let you know that mastery of this principle will either come gradually with time, or it can happen instantly. Manifestation cannot be seen as a quick fix, but instead it's something you have to work hard for but when you do, it becomes actually quite simple. A truth that helped awaken me to the fact that I am masterful at manifesting, which in turn allowed for my desires to manifest naturally and with so much ease and grace. Out of the many life-changing and self-help book I have read, it is this understanding that has been by far the most instrumental in my development as a human being. In addition to taking responsibility for your own reality and happiness, once you get this feeling it will become second nature to manifest what you want especially if you are deliberate about what you want. Are you ready for mastery? When I first started manifesting, I only focused on what I want and matching that frequency. The result was that manifesting became all about attracting my desires. And, although I wasn't entirely wrong, my focus was somewhat off. Manifestations are the inner state of being reflected on a feeling level. Manifesting is just reflecting your state of being to the world. It's nothing to do with your outer, physical reality. Neville Goddard was the first person in the world to talk about this principle. He called it living in the wish fulfilled. To manifest anything you want, all you have to do is embody your desired state of mind. It's a very simple process that starts with focusing on what you want and then changing your thoughts to reflect that desire. You are a soul creator. So, that means you have access to this possibility. All you need to do is choose to feel that truth deep within your body and mind, always. Know that the universe wants to support you, it just doesn't know how yet. It is fulfilling your needs anonymously. The universe is always filling in that gap. The void, the want that you think you lack, is no lack at all. It's the divine gently pulling at your skirt, to remind you of your abundance. As a mother, it's your birthright to supply your unborn child with all it needs to thrive. You are divine. You're walking magic. It's time that you step into your queenship and claim the life of your dreams. Cultivate those feelings and figure out what you want. Feel it deep in your body and know that it's yours. Feel its essence as a palpable truth. With time, it will become your reality. One of my favorite ways to activate my desires is by repeating to myself, it is mine and it feels so good. The principle at work here is believing that you're whole, that you deserve what you want. When this happens, the feelings of overwhelm and happiness will manifest. The thing you want is right in front of you. All you have to do is nurture it by developing a practice of focusing on how good you feel when thinking about it. Your emotional state is your point of attraction. Incorporate this feeling state into practicing spell work and manifesting rituals, and you'll see how quickly and easily manifesting with the law of attraction starts to become. When you learn to maintain the flow of pure consciousness, your manifestations will come naturally, like pouring yourself a cup of water. Rather than looking at your desires as something to occur outside of yourself, it is much easier to focus on them as something that could occur inside of you. Know that you already deserve whatever it is you want and start feeling benefited by it right now. Stop trying to attract something from a place of absence. This is the secret. It was my privilege to share some insight with you today. I am happy to know that I have helped you on your manifesting journey. Thank you for being here with me.